हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू आवर यूट्यूब चैनल एकेडेमिया अम्बाला टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस द टॉपिक जनरेशन ऑफ कंप्यूटर सो चिल्ड्रन व्हाट डज जनरेशन एक्चुअली मींस जनरेशन रेफर्स टू द स्टेट ऑफ इंप्रूवमेंट इन द डेवलपमेंट ऑफ प्रोडक्ट इफ वी हैव डेवलप्ड एनी प्रोडक्ट एंड if we want to see how far the product has changed from older to the newer one this period of development is known as generation in computers with each development the circuitry has gotten smaller and more advanced how many generations of computer are there children there are five generations of computer they are first generation second generation third generation fourth generation and fifth generation first generation computers were developed between 1945 to 1955 Second generation computers were developed between 1955 to 1965. Third generation computers were developed between 1965 to 1975. Fourth generation computers were developed between 1975 to 1989. In fifth generation computers were developed between 1989 till present. so we can say that the fifth generation computers describes the coming up technology now we are going to see the characteristics of the generation of computers the first generation computers were based on vacuum tubes technology first generation computers were very large in size the operating speed of first generation computers were very slow they generated large amount of heat students here you can see the image of first generation of computer how large they were and this shows the technology used in the first generation computers that is the vacuum tubes second generation computers second generation computers were based on transistor technology instead of vacuum tubes second generation computers were smaller as compared to first generation second generation computers were more reliable and less prone to hardware failure they generated less amount of heat children here you can see the image of second generation computers in comparison with first generation computer second generation computers were smaller in size and the technology used in second generation computers was transistors third generation computers integrated circuit was used as a technology in third generation computers integrated circuits are smaller than transistors but it can work as fast as thousands of them third generation computers were smaller in size and cheaper as compared to second generation computers third generation computers consumes less power and generates less heat here you can see the third generation of computer which is very small in comparison with both the first generation and the second generation computers and this is the technology that is the integrated circuit technology was used in the third generation computers next is fourth generation computers 
microprocessor technology was used in the fourth generation computer thousands of integrated circuits were built onto a single silicon chip fourth generation computers were more powerful and very small in size the fourth generation computers operating speed was very fast here you can see how the computer's size has been changed from room size computer to a desktop or a laptop computer and this is the technology used in the fourth generation computer that is the microprocessor fifth generation computers computers that are currently being developed and researched are the fifth generation computers these are the most advanced computers here you can see scientists are trying to develop a computer that can think on their own this is called artificial intelligence robots works on this technology so students what is artificial intelligence artificial intelligence is the ability of a computer or a machine to think and learn that's all for today